All right, back at y'all with some more boxing news and updates. You already know this your boy, Love One and Hate One. Let's go ahead and talk about this real quick. Now, for all the people out there that been wondering who is really going to fight next, he's going to fight this guy named Ahira Davies, or Ahiri Davies. I have trouble pronouncing his name. Ahira Davies is a good fighter. A lot of people kind of turned on him when he lost to Josh Taylor, especially the way that he lost to Josh Taylor. But I remember about five to ten years ago, people was talking about Ahiri Davis like he was going to be the next Floyd. Ahiri Davis got power, decent boxing ability, and I do feel like he can stop Rolando Romero. Being that Ahiri Davis, he does have a good left hand. And we all know that Roley Romero's kryptonite is the left hand. He is very susceptible to left hands. Javante Davis got him up out of there with a left hand. The punch that knocked him out in sparring was a left-hander. The guy he fought in his last fight, the old man, hurt him with a left hand. So, Roley Romero needs to be careful in this fight. A Harry Davis is a problem, especially when it comes down to Roley Romero. And a lot of you guys don't know, a Harry Davis, he's very cool with Floyd Mayweather. So if he pulls this off against Roley, he could do a lot more business with Floyd Mayweather Jr. Now with that being said, Ahiri Davis, we all know he can be hurt. Roley's, in my opinion, he's a big 140 pounder. He does have power and Roley is quick. All right. And you guys can say what you want to say, but I think Roley can box a little bit. He did show it in a tank fight and some other fights. Remember I said a little bit. So go ahead and set this shit up. And the one thing about Roley, we know when he fights, somebody getting knocked out. Rather it's him or rather it's his opponent. And the same thing goes for Ahari Davis. So I'm just ready to see a good fight, you guys. I'm out.